assigning RNS nomenclature or configuration. The sequence rule number one say assign priority to each item bonded to the chiral carbon on the basis of atomic number of the first item attached to the chiral carbon. Here are some exa examples of the groups or the atoms with increasing priority on the basis of the atomic number. Let us see one example how to assign the priority. In this molecule, the four different atta groups attached to this chiral carbon are CS3 methyl group, then chlorine, hydrogen and OH hydroxyl groups. How to assign the priority? Here, chlorine will be given the first priority with atomic number 17, then oxygen hydroxyl group, atomic number 6, then carbon methyl group with atomic number 6, the last one is hydrogen with atomic number 1. Therefore, this is a 1, 2, 3, 4 priority is given. For carbon carbon here we have to see the next item to, for example here after carbon there are all hydrogens but in this case after carbon there is one more carbon so this carbon will be given preference for this carbon now as chlorine is the number one with atomic number 17 then in between these two group ethyl group will be given preference then the methyl group and the last one is the hydrogen with the lowest atomic number sequence rule number three states that if, if second atom is also same, then look for the presence of the double bonds. Double bonded groups with the similar atoms are always given preference over the single bonded one. For example, in this compound, here, chlorine is the first item with atomic number 17. There is a tie between these two groups, that is carbon-carbon first item is same and also the second atom is also same, carbon-carbon. But in this case, in the vinyl group, there is a double bond as compared to the ethyl group. So this vinyl carbon will be given the second preference.
with a darkened bond which is indicate that it is coming towards us and the bromine is represented by the dashed lines or dashed bonds it will indicate that it is going away from the plane it can be represented in this way yeah, this is the ch3 group coming towards us it is a bromine that is going away from us and this is chlorine it is hydrogen now if you are observing this molecule from this angle on your left hand side will be ch3 on your right hand side will be bromine i am just rotating it so that it will look that you are observing from this angle so it will look like this after rotation 90 degree so this is the bromine this is the chlorine methyl and this is the hydrogen and if you draw it it will look like this if you rotate by 90 degree and you convert into the